Welcome to the Fashion Fusion Show. I'm your host, Amber J, back again this week with the latest of the who, the what, the where of fashion. Let me take you then to a comparison of New York City and LA, how New Yorkers dress and how LA dresses. So how would be a button skirt worn in New York City? In New York City, you will see it with a lovely cool jacket, while in LA, the same button skirt would be worn with a long jacket and a striped shirt. So let me take you to New York City and how would Olivia wear a little red dress? She might wear it with a pretty scarf and a pointy heels with chain strappy sandals. At the same time, if we go to LA, how would Julie wear the same red pretty dress? She would wear it with white laid back sneakers and a fun woven hat. So how would New York City wear denim? How would they do that? They might pair it with a pair of sophisticated heels and a nice sweater and a colorful jacket. When Amy, if we take Amy in LA, how would she wear the same denim look? She might do it with a slingback shoes and a white loose fitting jeans and a denim blouse. And the number one celebrity shoe style of the season and the sensation. A block heel was seen worn by Kourtney Kardashian absolutely rocking the look and Kate Hudson flaunting away in those block heels. So don't forget to get this season your number one block heels. People will stare so make it worth their while. So is it makeup or breakup? The Paris lip color of the season and the latest sensation was Estee Edit Lipstick by Estee Lauder. The company came out with the beautiful lip colors more than dazzling your lips. In order to feel relaxed and calm, one must have the massaging feeling on the face. And the newest product out there is the hydrating mask called The Verb. And the third most sizzling product is the Nail In Company. Now what does it do, girls? You just spray it on and spray it on your nails and voila, there you go, your nails are done. And ladies, don't we love the feeling when we go to a salon and get our hair blow dried and shampooed? Well, I have just the product for you. It's called Bumble and Bumble Surf Foam Spray Blow Dry. And I'm absolutely in love with this new product. It's called NARS. It is a velvet matte skin tint with a broad spectrum of SPF 30. Ladies, you put it on and you will look absolutely stunning. The only drama I enjoy is in my lashes. That's why I love the new product called Smashbox X-Rated Mascara. Fashion Fusion takes you to Hollywood with the top 10 best dressed celebrities and who were they and who made the list and who did not. Rihanna wore a couture pink flowy gown of none other the designer Jim Beatista Belli. The singer arrived in a pink cupcake gown and she wore it so effortlessly. Julianne Moore absolutely bedazzled in a black Giorgio Armani gown. She chose a plunging black Giorgio Armani gown with feathers and beads for the 68th Cannes Film Festival. Emma Stone rocked the look in Lanvin and considered her custom Lanvin jumpsuit a risk that paid off girls. Everything from the hand beaded bodice to the taffeta bow sash was absolutely perfect.
Blake Lively rocked a Monique Lillier gown with a voluminous tulle skirt, a fitted lace bodice, and flowing train. And with this choice, girl, she also revealed her encyclopedic fashion memory, asking for the dress from a three-year-old collection. Who other than Jennifer Lopez and Valentino Hotel Couture? At the 69th annual Tony Awards, Lopez brought her star power to Broadway's biggest nights in this strapless navy gown with gold sequin detailing. J.Lo, you absolutely look beautiful. Taylor Swift in L.A. Saab For the 2015 Grammys, Swift chose a turquoise L.A. Saab that featured a short skirt under the ball gown. Kate Blanket rocked the look again in Giorgio Armani at the 40th anniversary Silos opening in sleek ivory Giorgio Armani suit, separates with a black obai inspired tie belt at the waist complete with black pumps. Now Kate, you always look amazing to our viewers. Lupita and Gucci at Cannes, the actress opted for a custom pleated chiffon gown with hand painted floral crystals along the waist and plunging neckline. Lupita, you are beautiful. Number 9 is Emma Watson in Ralph Lauren collection. She's strong and assertive palette of black and white. Watson attended the Duke of Cambridge Royal Dinner at Windsor Castle in England wearing an elegant white and grey ensemble paired with a Roger Vivier Boito de Neuert clutch. Last but not least, Kiara Knightley in Del Paso. She chose an embellished flowing look from Del Paso Spring 2015 collection for the Critic Choice Awards. And this is a wrap for Hollywood people and let us take you to Bollywood. So who is going to walk the ramp for Manish Malhotra Lakhmi Fashion Week 2016? It is none other than Arjun Kapoor with Jacqueline Fernandez. Arjun appeared in a black metallic silver Sherwani and Jacqueline looked absolutely stunning in a nude floor length gown. Among the guests were also Karina in a nude camel sari. Absolutely divine. This will be the first time that Arjun will be paired with Jacqueline Fernandez on the ramp for Manish Malhotra Fifth Element Collection. The celebrity designer was so excited to share the news with our viewers, he actually took to Twitter to announce the good news and share his excitement with us. Atiya, the charming daughter of Sunil Sethi, the actor, will be walking the ramp for Amazon Fashion Week for Maybelline, New York. She is the brand ambassador for Amazon and not only that, she was absolutely thrilled about giving the opportunity. The movie heroine of the hero movie. She will be showcasing the Pret collection which is modern, edgy and fun and defines women's beauty. She also appeared in Nushka Lula New Summer collection in a lovely yellow dress in metallic silver flat shoes and looking absolutely pretty. Fitness is a lifestyle with no finish line, so that's why I recommend your host Amber J. A 20 minute of running will keep your heart healthy and active. And before I go, always remember, don't let anyone dull your sparkle. People will stare, so make it worth their while. Fashion is an art and you are the canvas. I'm your host, Amber J. Stay tuned for next week's Fashion Fusion Show. Love you guys. Take care. <laughs>